this is a difficult conversation in our society. You have, you know, two beautiful black children who are your adopted children. Does that does this moment mean more to your family uh, to stand up there with Black Lives Matter? We'll be back in a minute, everybody. Aaron Boone was emotional earlier today in the Bronx, where the Yankees are taking part in baseball's annual celebration of Jackie Robinson. The tribute comes amidst a groundbreaking movement throughout the sports world in the name of racial justice. Last night, the Mets made their voices heard in Queens. They and the Marlins emptied their dugouts at game time, and on the eve of Jackie Robinson Day, they observed a 42-second moment of silence in memory of those who have lost their lives to police brutality. The scheduled matchup became one of seven MLB games postponed Thursday as protests continued in the aftermath of the Jacob Blake shooting in Kenosha, Wisconsin. Before the teams departed the field, a Black Lives Matter t-shirt was placed at the top of home plate. This morning, Major League Baseball Players Association Executive Director Tony Clark released this statement. The events of recent days, weeks, and months serve as a stark and unfortunate reminder that Jackie Robinson's fight for racial equality in our society endures. As we recognize his legacy today, players of all races and backgrounds join together to continue the work of Jackie and all of the civil rights leaders who suffered and sacrificed before and after him so that all of our children can one day grow up in a society that offers genuine equality, free of fear, free of discrimination, and free to pursue their dreams. The Players Association is committed to support our players in the effort to achieve these important goals, both in society and in our sport. Hey everyone, welcome to another edition of Yankees Batting Practice Today, presented by Audi. I'm Mike McGrady. We'll have more later with John Flaherty on the statements being made around sports and the legacy of Jackie Robinson. Today, the Yankees and the Mets open up a big weekend of baseball, five games in three days, starting with a doubleheader. Our sound from the stadium begins with Aaron Boone's answer to the question he was asked at the top of our show. Okay, everybody, we're back. Aaron. All right. Um... Yeah, and answering Marley's question, um, you know, I would just say, <clears throat> you know, and and I know, I know I'm talking to a lot of people out there. You know, it's just been it's been a hard and heavy year, um, and you know, a heartbreaking year in so many ways. And uh, you know, for my family too. Um, but but I think that's the case for a lot of people of of all different backgrounds and and races. So <clears throat> my prayer is just that you know we continue to even though we're going through some dark times um, that at the end of this we're better we're better for it. And uh, that's my continued prayer. It's been a tough time. It's been a tough week. Um, um, just. Um really hard time for everybody that's going on what's going on in the world um just want to say i want to be here for certain people um, especially out some of our younger minor league athletes um minor league players who's who's asking for for us to, to to say something to let them know that we're behind them um we're here for them and it's been a tough road and and, and hopefully um voices can be heard and, and that's all we want right now g did you have any initial thoughts um, yeah, it's, it's been tough. It's been, uh, uh, you, you see it time and time again and you, you wonder when is it going to stop? When is it, um, when are people finally going to listen? When are you going to use, uh, understand that, um, you can help no matter what color you are and that, um, it's, it's not. It's not political. It's not for for anything but reality. I mean, this this is this is the life we lived in. This is a life that that um, a lot of a lot of people in the, in America struggle to to bring up. And and though um, 
Though we're in the big leagues and everyone thinks every, uh, you know, we're robots and, and all is is fine and dandy, we know we know the road that it took to get here, and we know um, from our peers and from from life experiences the difficulties on every step to get to where we are now. So it's not just forget of it's not forget of 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 that road. It's not a a time to just shut up and swing, shut up and dribble. This this isn't that time. This is time to to take reality for what it is and, and start helping to make a damn change. Because this is unacceptable what's been going on. And and it hurts, man. I mean the 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 conversations with my mom, with my grandma, the the hearing their stories, hearing what they had to go through and, and then seeing the similarities of what's going on now is just uh it, it hurts it, it's 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 unacceptable and and it needs to be changed